Grunfeld defense, Burel variation, 5, C66. B2007.00. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. Opening with the queen's pawn. The move d5 establishes control over the e4 square, frees up the light squared bishop, and builds a presence in the center. A wing pawn is available in the queen's gambit to attack the center and divert black's attention away from the e4 square. The d5 pawn is supported by c6 in the Slav defense. The battle for the e4 square is launched by nc3 by attacking the d5 position. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. That's good. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is the final book action. That's fine. It is good. A solid choice. It is excellent. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. It is ideal. This misses the chance to offer an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. That's a decent move. That's good. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. That's good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. Although white lost their edge, the game is still almost evenly matched. It is incorrect. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. That's good. It is a fair deal after all captures. That's good. Backs off. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. Recaptures. This poses a fork piece threat. It is ideal. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That's fine. It is good. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. It is incorrect. There was only one good move there. This misses an opportunity to win a pawn. It is a miss. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. A solid choice. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That's fine. It is good. This is a missed chance to offer an equal exchange of goods. It is incorrect. 
This puts the opposing rook in a position to lose control of the open file. That's good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. This seizes a helpless pawn. That's good. Recaptures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is quite good. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is excellent. That's a decent move. That's good. A very strong play. It is excellent. In the end game, an active king is essential, and removing it from the rear rank is the first step. It is quite good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This protects the attacked pawn. It is good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. A solid choice. It is excellent. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That's fine. It is good. Very precise. It is best. This exchange is fair. That's good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. This is the only good move. It is best. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game.